By Thursday, Chad Wilcox had reached his wits end. Oh, I'm very angry about it. I think this is ridiculous. Powerful winds during Sunday's storm ripped out Comcast wires near his home in Citrus Heights, disconnecting a line, another wire hanging over this fence. Windstorm, it was really, really, really bad. Uh, we had branches going down all over the neighborhood. He called Comcast customer service, he says, telling them he felt unsafe. They're not taking my complaint seriously and they're not giving us the services that we're paying them for. After multiple calls with no resolution, he told them he was calling KCRA 3. And she sort of chuckled and said, will you do what you have to do? We'll do what we have to do. We reached out to the company on Thursday, a spokesperson writing in part. For our crews to make the necessary repairs to restore service, they must first have access to the area. In some situations, this becomes a problem since some roads, especially in remote areas, remain closed due to fallen trees and debris. Two hours later... Comcast sent somebody out here and uh, he went up the pole and, and he clipped a couple of the wires. As his neighbors keep cleaning up, he says he's relieved this is one problem that is now resolved. The guy was very professional about it. Problem solved. In Citrus Heights, Leanne Denier, KCRA 3 News.